Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'm going to be talking to you about this 2007 Mercedes ML63. It's done just 63,000 kilometres since it was brand new and it is in in absolutely immaculate condition. It comes in this beautiful colour combination, silver with beige leather interior and it also comes with some great options. It's got a full Mercedes-Benz service history from you and it looks like it's been serviced on time every time. It's got the 6.3 litre V8 which is very reliable if it's well looked after and one of the most important things is to use the correct oil. The good thing about this car having had every single service done at Mercedes-Benz we know that that's the case. If you're looking at other ML63s and it's been elsewhere um, that is something I would certainly look at. I absolutely love the colour combination, it's nice to see that there's still some people out there with some class. Silver with beige interior is very nice. Most of them are black with black, silver with black. Um, this has been owned by a very fussy person who sort of kind of reminds me of myself, you know, who made sure they kept the leather nice and supple, made sure it was always conditioned, the car was always clean, the carpets, they bought continental tyres all round and literally every light every panel every wheel is perfect on this car I would say it's easily the best ML 63 for sale in the country from 2007 it's got very low kilometers you'll see a lot of other cars with over 200,000 kilometers it's got the two original keys remote keys Harman Kardon sound is pretty standard push button start heated seats, air-conditioned seats but just look at the leather, it's absolutely immaculate sorry there's some shadows and things on the seats from the light this would suit a very very fussy buyer unfortunately although it's an AMG because it's an ML it is a family car and a lot of them do get knocked around they're not serviced on time because families have other things to worry about with children and pets and things like that so unfortunately the car ends up being neglected but this is not one of those cars the back seat quite literally does not look like it's ever been used there's no little marks at the back of the seat from baby seats the leather's nice and soft. We haven't even detailed it. It's come in, we've given it a quick wash and I've done some photos and a video. It's great actually. It'd be nice not to have to spend two or three hours in every car that comes in to clean them up. It's got a tow bar. It's got the European plates that look fantastic. Tinted windows. Electric boot or tailgate. It's got the rear luggage cover that often gets lost. Again, family car, they take it out, to, you know, take a load to the tip and never goes back in the car. This car does not look like it's ever had anything, doesn't look like it's had anything in the back at all. That's actually just a piece of fluff. It's absolutely beautiful and uh, it's not a car I think will last very long, especially with 63,000 kilometres. I'll, uh, I'll start it up. It's nice and quiet and smooth. I'll start it up and we'll eventually walk around to the engine bay. Push button. It's, it's, it's actually very quiet. It's not a car that I think's been driven hard at all. A lot of these cars are quite susceptible to how they've been driven. If someone had driven it like a maniac for the past few months or years I find they tend to the car is a lot louder even when it's idling it's got a keyless entry I just can't stop looking at it it's absolutely beautiful and look I understand that some people prefer a black interior 
um, I much prefer something a bit more interesting like this also find a car with beige or cream interiors a nicer environment it's got the original mats which are also immaculate and someone's really loved this car and if you're buying any car you want to buy one that's loved but especially if you're buying an AMG oh the logbooks we must have a look at the logbooks but before we do I might open the bonnet and uh, the headlights are nice and clear it's not been parked outside it's really the the sort of ML 63 that I'm sure a lot of people have been been waiting for after looking at what else is available just open the bonnet nice and clean in the engine bay you probably hear a lot through the microphone but it, you'd barely know the car was running it's nice and smooth it's quiet if you find one which which may not have had the right oil used in it or hasn't been serviced properly you often get a bit of a knock 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 whether it's cold or hot it just goes knock knock or tick 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 same with the C63s but yeah this is spot on and when you're buying any AMG you can't buy a cheap car you've got to buy the best car you can find for a fair price which is exactly what I think this car is I've just turned it off and everything's so lovely about this car I mean, I've actually still, I've got a, a 2001 MY02 um, ML55 still, um, which is also, which I think is a fantastic car. It's like this car in terms of condition, because I am very fussy when I, uh, with my cars. But I really, I can't get out of it because it's just so reliable. All the books are present. I'm sure the service book will be at the bottom. Oh no, good, here we go. So if we look at the service history. Looks like it's got the original plates on it from when it was new. And this is how it goes. In short, it was serviced at 10,012. Wow, 13,000, 16,000, 21,000, 31,000, 40,000, 50,000 and 60,000 that's a really good history so I serviced in late 2017 16 15 14 13 12 10 so there was a bit of a gap there because it only went from 13,000 16,000 in that period 9 8 wow you're not going to get much better than that thank you very much whoever's owned this car it's nice to see it's been well looked after and looking as I like as I always say there are cheaper cars out there like sometimes you find one but it might not have had a service literally for three years or it's done 90,000 kilometers there's three stamps in the book I don't know but if you have been looking for what I think is easily the best ML 63 for sale in the country from 2006 or 2007 this is it and I think this car really needs to be seen to be appreciated if you have any specific questions about the car please give us a call and you know, we'd certainly be more than happy to help you but it really is very impressive and I do appreciate you taking the time to watch our video we're only 20 minutes from Sydney Airport we offer in-house finance and we look forward to speaking to you soon.